F. La Roca and Sons is your number one source for all your property needs. With over 30 years of serving Westchester, we built up a portfolio of thousands of satisfied customers and saved them thousands of dollars. From driveways, patios, steps, retaining walls, drainage systems, complete yard makeovers to landscape installations and property maintenance. If you're interested in any of these services, visit our website or call us now for a free estimate at 632-4819. Flavia Laraca, 140 Sussex Road. First, I'd like to thank you all for giving me the opportunity to come here and speak with you this evening. Um, I've been in New Rochelle for uh, 36 years. I came here as a young child. I grew up in New Rochelle, graduated from New Rochelle High School, built my business in New Rochelle, and now I have a family with five kids here in New Rochelle. I'm also one of the property owners right on the area where the city is considering relocating the new city garages and uh, the city yard, uh, right along uh, the skate park at Fowler's Park by uh, uh, Fifth Avenue. Um, I must say, uh, at first, when we first met, uh, we received the notice just two days prior to our meeting. Uh, I was told by some of the officials who were there at the meeting that uh, there was going to be some uh, transparency, we were going to be kept in the loop, we were going to be informed of all things, but it has been everything but since then. We've had to make the initial step to come to the city to find out what's going on, and we've been notified as property owners at the last minute that uh, the city needs uh, access to your facility because we need to do inspections, we need to do surveys, we need to do drilling and so forth. Um, in addition to that, uh, having built my business by myself, uh, I think uh, it is unfair to have your property that you work so hard for be pulled from under your feet with this abuse of power. And I say abuse of power because eminent domain is made to be used for necessary use. Um, just to try to comprehend how you're trying to fit almost nine acres into a four-acre site or say that you're going to have different location, I think that's going to be more of a burden on the taxpayers because they're going to have to pay for more uh, wear and tear of equipment, more overtime, more fuel expenditures and so forth going from one location to another. But above all, you're going to be ruining uh, a community and a part of the city where children love to play. There's a 20-acre ball field on one side with a skate park and the location where you want to put the city facility there, the DPW garage abuts right up to neighborhoods where there's small children who play in the street. Many a times I see the kids playing right in front of my property there. And even my own kids like to come there and play there. When that property is then uh, converted into a city yard, what will happen to that area? What would happen to the neighborhood? What would happen to the street on Fifth Avenue with all the traffic that's in? It's barely a one-lane street and there's already too much traffic there to begin with. I think the city can do better in finding a more suitable location. Uh, to either relocate or redevelop the area where they're at and make it into a state-of-the-art DPW facility without trying to force people out and having officials tell them, move to another town, move to Mount Vernon, or move to somewhere else. Uh, it's your problem where you go, but we have the right to take this property. So that's all I wanted to say to City Council. Thank you, sir. Good evening, Mr. Mayor and City Council. My name is Maria LaRocca. I reside at 140 Sussex Road. First of all, I'd like to enter my full written statement uh, for the city clerk to keep for the record. Thank you again for the opportunity to speak. Um, I am the president of the New Rochelle United Against Eminent Domain and the owner, uh, one of the owners of Flavia LaRocca and Sons and one of the businesses that would be demolished if the city plans for Fifth Avenue and East Street are approved. New Rochelle United opposes the city plans to demolish 10 longtime businesses along Fifth Avenue and East Street to make way for private development. The threatened businesses employ more than 70 people, and we have collectively served the community for more than 130 years. We have two major arguments against the plan. First, the city's plan is unnecessary and would cause tremendous harm to the 10 long-serving businesses and their families. Second, the new Department of Public Works location would be a huge nuisance to the surrounding community. First, the city's plan is not necessary. The city wants to relocate DPW onto the site of seven construction companies in order to redevelop the current waterfront DPW site with private development. The city has identified other locations that make far more sense than the relocation of the DPW that wouldn't require eminent domain. Eminent domain is supposed to be used for public uses that are actually necessary. Eminent domain is not a tool of convenience. What the city is proposing is a completely unnecessary land grab. 
we ask that you find somewhere else to relocate the city yard that doesn't require condemning successful businesses. And by the way, we were never for sale and we are not for sale. Please do not threaten the livelihoods of over 70 people and their families. Please do not violate our right to keep what we have worked so hard to own. If the city <coughs> condemns my business, we don't know what we'll do. We have operated Flavia LaRocca and Sons out of our current location for nearly 17 years. Our business, our family name, and our reputation will suffer if this happens. I want city council to understand the weight of my decision. My husband Flavio and I have five children, one who has a rare disease and is on cancer medication. This proposed project and the threat of losing our business and livelihood have taken a tremendous toll on my family and all the other threatened business owners. If no other reason, I urge you to drop this plan for the sake of my sick daughter. Another threatened business owner, Mr. Arbitri of Arbitri and Sons, has been at that location for nearly 50 years. City Council should only consider relocating businesses if a project is absolutely necessary. I urge you to listen to the public opinion. This will cause a traffic nightmare. The exit of all the city trucks that will feed onto Fifth Avenue, which is narrow one street lane, would suffer from serious traffic issues. Plus the Barnard School is only 1,200 feet away from this location and will cause a serious safety issue for the children and school bus area. New Rochelle need not to destroy 10 businesses. You have the power to stop this. Thank you, ma'am. Uh -huh.